So uh, if you have multiple keys or multiple drivers using your Tesla, you can tie the uh, driver profiles, which are right here, uh, to uh, each key. Looks like we got the game of chess, which is cool. Fun. That's interesting. When I touch, it shows you the available positions. So some other stuff looks like uh, they have game controls. This is so cool. I've never played this game before, so it's something new. Media volume improvements. It looks like when you uh, let someone out of the car. The music temporarily. Dog mode improvements. Uh, looks like the manual climate controls. Welcome to Tesla Life. If you like this video, please subscribe and share the video with your friends. And I would appreciate if you press that little like button. Hey, I just received 2019.28.2. Uh, Let's check out what came in. Looks like uh, we can now link a key to a driver profile. So uh, if you have multiple keys or multiple drivers using your Tesla, you can tie the uh, driver profiles, which are under here, uh, to uh, each key. And it looks like you do it under uh, controls, uh, lock screen, um, locks, key cards, and so I have my uh, Galaxy S10, uh, but then I have the actual key card too. Uh, actually, I have two key cards, uh, and then my old uh, Galaxy phone, and uh, I can tie it to a profile right here. I guess you can give a name to the key, uh, and you can delete a key if you want. I do a back in and up. This moves the seat all the way up. Sometimes I got a lot of stuff in the back of the car and I want to get access to it. And then this moves the seat all the way back, which is pretty convenient. What you do to connect uh, a key to a profile is you go to that profile. So if I go to Nick and um, or I set Nick as my profile, then when I click here, it puts Nick profile to that key. I can also put Nick to that key. If I switch my profile to, let's say, uh, back, then when I come here, I assume my back goes to that key card. So you basically have to put yourself into that profile and then you can uh, click here to put the current setting to a key card. I'm going to put uh, this key card back to um, Nick. Actually put all my key cards to Nick. Looks like we got the game of chess, which is cool. Uh, let's check it out. Uh, it, all the games are under here. Uh, under games, there it is. Start a game of chess. Oh, I guess we have to hit start. Okay, then we go over here. This is a classic move. Or classic start. That gets blocked there. Let's just have fun. <laughs> That's interesting. When I touch it shows you the available positions. I don't know where that one's, oh, that's where it came from. And it's tracking the uh, moves here, it's timing it. Driver, Tesla's, <laughs> Tesla makes their moves very fast. Uh, let's uh, go there, we get taken. I'm just playing around here, but uh, that's cool. You touch here and you can see you can go there, there, or there, which is nice. Uh, let's go there. And uh, we're probably going to lose this match pretty quick, but that's pretty cool. You can also pause the game, I guess. So if you come to a stop, uh, you can pause. I wonder what the settings are. Uh, driver white, uh, black level one. <laughs> I guess you can uh, 
Oh, level five, Al 9000. That's great. That's great. That's great. <laughs> Different uh, levels of play. I definitely want to stay at level one. Uh, and then you exit and try okay. another game, Beach Buggy Racer 2. There's the warning message. Wow. Got a little music here. It's the first game that actually has to load that I've seen. I guess it's a little bit more complicated than others. Oh wow, very cool. One player. That's good enough. Chill, that's cool. <laughs> this is great. Oh wow. Pretty impressive. Hopefully you can see the whole screen. Steer left, steer right, brake, continue. Uh, activate your power-up slots by driving through globe orbs. Use the driver's special ability once per race. Get third place or better, unlock. <laughs> this is cool. <laughs> Try using the steering wheel. Whoa! Wow. I am, I am a terrible driver. I'm oversteering, I think. Let me steer slightly less. There we go. Wow, it's very sensitive steering. This is great. Oh, I, I, I looked down at the camera just to see if it was going. Wow, this is very cool. Wow, it's very, very, very uh, sensitive steering. So I'm, I'm uh, I don't know if I can show you my, oops, steering. I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm steering way too much. Okay, so I'm going really slow steering now. This is so cool. I've never played this game before, so it's something new. I'm actually getting good at it now. Whoa! <laughs> Graphics are fantastic. <sighs> Whoa! <laughs> okay, that's enough. So some other stuff. Looks like uh, they have game controller support for Beach Buggy. Uh, I was just using my steering wheel. Media volume improvements. It looks like when you uh, let someone out of the car it mutes the uh, music temporarily uh, and uh, while your phone is paired on Bluetooth the audio volume matches the vehicle's volume level that's pretty cool dog mode improvements uh, it looks like the manual climate controls um, are restricted uh, except for the temperature so uh, I guess a pet couldn't accidentally uh, hit something maybe and that's uh, all previous stuff I haven't shown you these maybe in a in a little while so here we go just so you have them cool thanks everyone
Hey, thanks for watching. If you like this video, please subscribe on the top left and share the video with your friends. My other Model 3 videos are here in the middle. If you want 1,000 miles of free supercharging, please use my referral code listed on the bottom. My Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter accounts are on the right. And check out my new channel, Pickleball is Life. It's a great game, and subscribe on the bottom left. Take care.